Welcome back for another Bicentennial Barn restoration update. Today we're working on the cupolas again. Specifically, I'm going to build the louvers and the body to hold them for each cupola. So we started out with cedar fence posts from Lowe's, cut them all to size. We're using cedar because it will never rot, at least not anytime soon. And then we had to paint them with this oil primer to soak in and protect the cedar. So I painted each edge because we're going to assemble that and we'll never be able to get paint in the cracks after the fact. So I basically assembly lined it on the ends with a roller and then painted the top and bottom individually for each louver slat so we can then assemble them. So I've got these dado cuts on the edges and for those I just loaded the paintbrush with oil primer and jammed it in there. And at that point I just stapled them all together. Well, just got paint on my camera. This fine shot right here of a staple gun. I also got paint on my staple gun and my staple gun hose. Do you know what I'm saying? Let me just get some paint on the off switch now. I think the amount of oil primer has reached critical mass. My eyes are starting to burn. It's time to put on this mask here. Well, despite the oil primer buildup and feeling a little goofy from breathing it for too long, I managed to get them all painted up and assembled. I, I finished painting the inside of the lat slats the next morning. So we got 16 total louvers, and that's four cupolas and four on each side. So at that point, we just need to build the bodies to hold them. So here's one of the frames for the middle of the cupola with a louver conveniently sitting inside it. These things have two layers of R15 XPS on the top and one on the side, so it's R30 roof, R15 walls, which is in compliance with the rest of the building. Then we coated the entire bodies with this Grace Ice and Water Shield building wrap, which as I've been told is the cure-all for problem roofing areas. It's also the most expensive building wrap you can possibly buy. But anyway, that pretty much covers it for building the bodies that hold the louvers for the cupolas. So the next video on this series, we're going to go over how to build the spires and eventually how to put the siding on this whole thing.